Hey guys, I am Rhett with the Mix Club, and in this video here, I'm going to show you a trick that I like to do with the bass guitar. Forgot about it, and I came back to it here, and I thought, you know what, I'm going to share this instead of just redoing the same stuff that's on the internet over and over. But anyway, this plug is by Slate Digital, and it is called the Mo TT, and it just kind of, I just put it on the factory default settings, maybe tweaked a couple things, and I have this really nice bass guitar sound, and I've had this saved for a long time, and I forgot about it, or I would have thrown it back on this track when I was doing some mixing. Anyway, guys, let's hop over and check this out. Okay, guys, so this is the Mo TT by Slate Digital, and basically what I did, I created myself a preset a long time ago, but... The preset is really nothing. I just opened up the plug, messed with it just a little bit, and this is what I came up with. Check out the bass guitar. Okay, now let's go ahead and let's kick this off. Now check it out. So you kind of get the idea, right? There's not a lot of sub going on with this bass guitar. Once again, let's go ahead and kick this back on. And I, I think what I like about this is I'm not like grabbing for something. If I'm wanting some of that extra low end, I'm not grabbing like our bass. So let's go ahead and let's just call up the default and let's just dial something in here pretty quick, okay? go ahead and go to the advanced setting so basically you have your downward compression and your upward compression and then right here this is going to get us some of that clankly string noise that can help cut through the mix okay check it out I think this is a great plug-in if you're struggling with a bass tone for a song. Um, I forgot about using it, and like I said, I'm kind of struggling putting out videos that have been done over and over and over. Even though it's something that I do in my process, I still want it to be, you know, something to help somebody kind of new and kind of fresh. So let's go ahead right now and let's pull up. This is my preset, as you can see right here. Not a lot has changed. Check it out. So yeah, if you want to, go ahead and copy this screen right here. And this is basically what I did to get this bass tone. Hey guys, I am Rhett with the Mix Club. I hope this tip helps you out. Make sure and like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and all that good stuff helps me out a bunch. I'm trying to grow the channel. If you've stuck around, I appreciate it. Anyway guys, till next time, I'm Rhett with the Mix Club, man. Be safe, y'all. See ya.